electricity come from? In today's world, we rely heavily on electricity. We need it for our homes, for our hospitals, to cook or to travel, even non-electronic things were made and delivered to us using electricity. But do we know what electricity is? Electricity is phenomenon that exists in nature, but can also be created, stored, and used. This generated form of electricity is comprised of atoms that contain a positive or negative charge. These charged atoms are moving or flowing, and we use this energy to power all of our electronic devices. To create electricity for our homes, we have used power plants. A power plant typically uses fuels like coal or natural gas, fossil fuels, or nuclear energy to create heat. This heat is then used to boil water to make steam. Through a series of pipes, steam is directed to a turbine or fan which is connected to a generator. Generators use magnetism to create electricity, which is then sent to your homes through our power grids. Power plants like these are considered to be non-renewable energy sources because the fuel cannot be reused after being converted into heat to create steam. This process of burning fuel also creates a byproduct of harmful greenhouse gases that pollute our ecosystems. What is renewable energy? Now that we've learned how typically power plants burn fossil fuels like coal or natural gas to create heat, let's discuss a cleaner way to make electricity. Renewable energy are methods of creating electricity with fuel or energy that can be reused. Renewable resources include natural energy forms like wind, water, or solar, as well as geothermal, biofuels, or even biomass waste. Unlike non-renewable energy, renewable energy does not directly create greenhouse gas pollutants and use methods that will not run out. There are different methods to creating renewable energy, but many of them use generators, just like a typical power plant. Hydroelectric power plants use flowing water to turn the turbines of a generator, and while wind turbines use wind. Some methods like geothermal or solar thermal use heat to create steam which turns a turbine, while photovoltaic cells or solar panels use sunlight to create electricity through flowing electrons. Identify the problem. As wind turbines account for approximately 24% of the renewable energy created in the United States, which is only about 11% of total energy produced, they are one of the most widely used forms of renewable energy worldwide. While there are many benefits to wind energy, there are also many challenges. The first of which is cost, wind turbines are expensive and as they only create electricity, when there's wind, many companies can't afford to produce wind turbines that may only be used part of the time. Wind turbines are also often considered to be ugly, loud, and can impact local wildlife negatively. Challenge constraints include, but are not limited to. You must address at least one of the defined drawbacks for wind turbines. You have one day to brainstorm, three days to build, and one day to test and evaluate. You must design your prototype to support the provided DC motor that will act as your generator. Your 3D model build volume may not exceed 36 in 3. You must incorporate at least three different materials. If you have any questions, please read the text and contact your instructor if you still don't understand.